WFNN. Headline News Update. NASDAQ off seven, uh, 79, S&P's off 80. Gold, gold contract trading down $25.70 at, at 1984. We have silver down 70 cents, $24.27 an ounce. Light sweet crude up 94 cents, $79.73 a barrel. Notes and bonds. A 10-year note down a full point plus four ticks at 111 flat. The 30-year off two points plus 11 ticks at 123.27 and king dollar. King Dollar not only rejected lower price out here today, but it's up 885 ticks, trading 101.773. The euro is at 109. The yen is at trading at a price point of 139. The British pound is at 128 to 1 the U.S. dollar. Now, check this out, folks, okay? Today would have been, if the Dow had, by the way, we're going to close at the lows, okay? When you get a failure like this and you've been up so many days in a row, you can expect more selling coming into the close. But check this out. This is amazing. If, in fact, the Dow had closed up today, that would have been the first time in 123 years that it closed up that many days in a row. How's that? Okay. Big stat, no doubt. If we go over to the S&Ps, we take a look at the S&Ps out here. What you're going to see out here is that we had the SPY got all the way, uh, made a new high, made up there, get, got there 459.45, you know, about uh, three hours ago, four hours ago. Uh, well, I guess, yeah, yeah, about noon. Noon, it just starts selling off. So what you're going to get right now, we'll see if we, what type of follow-through we get on a Friday Right now, coming into the close, however, bottom line, well, what we did do, now this gets really intriguing, we, you know, we had the high volume, and this is where these high volume lows, and inside the Tigers, then, uh, we had those Tigers, they were recognizing it, the, that high volume low was out there, first it went after the high volume low, that was the 45.68, we're at 45.67, we're already hit 45.65. That being said, my take is that you're going to get down another 10 or 20 points in this S&P. That's what normally happens when you have such a failure at highs after the Fed, all of the above. That's kind of just how that goes, okay? You know, you know, we'll see what kind of correction it's going to be, but that's normally what happens because it would be very easy to buy into that this morning. Stay right there, folks. We'll come right back.